Just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. Thank you, Kenny. How's that feeling? Not great. The hand is hot. Thumping a little bit. You seem okay for now. Yeah, totally. We don't have much time. Oh. We're about to have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets here. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. We'll try to find another way out of here. <laughs> thank you, Kenny. I appreciate that. Wait. <coughs> he used one hand to open it, couldn't he just like push this way? And then like I don't know. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. Chopping his arm off. Do we know it works? We don't know anything. We know there's gonna be a lot of blood. There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? 
Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. Let's do it. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Yeah. We're down here without a lot of options. Here we go. One... One... Fuck it. One arm Lee. Okay, one leg Lee. Seriously. Yeah. <clears throat> Easier when I thought he was out. Oh, Jesus. Fine. I'll go as fast as I can. You got that? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Try to stay still! <laughs> oh, God! I know! Keep going on. You've been out a while, man. It hurts so bad. But maybe now I got more time. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. Yeah. Good. The elevator's open. Let's go. I'll bring up the rear. I don't want to bleed on anyone. Was it that awkward sound? Jeez. Oh, We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Get going. said no head <laughs> for some reason. Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? 
That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Well, what do we do now? Maybe we can wait for an opening. We could be waiting a long time. Still, Lee's right, and that we gotta pick our time and go. Anybody know how far and in what direction the mansion is? We probably ought to start there. It's between us and River Street, so we can stop if we have to. Retrace our steps, maybe. And they get going towards the hotel where Clem's parents were staying. Okay. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... Uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost a lot of blood down there. If you find yourself getting winded, or worse, you gotta let us know. And it wasn't my favorite hand anyway. Well, you haven't lost your spirit. Seriously, though. Don't treat me any different. I got one goal, you hear me? Yeah, we do. Now what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now, let's get our bearings. Hospital must have run out of doctors. Into that fire. Can bottle? That looks like Crawford Square over there. Fuck that place. Did fix up our boat, though. We get Clementine and get right back. Make sure she wears her life jacket, okay? Something tells me she's not gonna want to. She walked away from whatever accident happened. But that doesn't really mean much. <clears throat> it's an extension ladder. Crystal. What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Hmm. Yeah. That could help. No way. It's higher than this room, for starters. That's a bell tower. Like the ones Molly used to draw the walkers around the city. Need some help with that? I got it. Damn it. The bells. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? My leg's feeling better. Let me do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. Maybe keep that shit to yourself next time? Yep.
this time. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit, man! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I was wishing I had my other hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? They're coming this way! Tons of them! Jesus! Now get back here! I think I have to jump! There's no way back! You can make it! It ain't that far! Or just a little hop. That's a tree. Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof! Do it. Don't get mad. The boat's gone. No shit, it's gone. Relax. Ben, what happened? They were waiting for me in here. Who? Vernon, his whole crew. Was Clementine with them? No. He seemed pissed you guys lost her and, well, they took it. They're gone. Ben, you are worthless. What happened to your arm? We cut it off. Ben, I could just kill you right now. I can't believe you didn't even put up a fight. I mean, they were sick cancer patients, so... Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We get the fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody asked you. You just did. Don't get fucking smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Get over it! Everyone keep it together. Nothing has changed, has it? Nothing has changed? I mean immediately. We stay the course. Don't turn on each other. Yeah, chill out, Kenny. Oh, God damn it. We can do this in the yard. Ben, I swear to God. What do we do without a boat? Get to the countryside. Dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Look, I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet. So put a pin in that, okay? Where the hell do you get off? I'm just saying we should all chill. Not just you. Chill? Bandits, hey, chill. Here's some pills. Vernon, chill. Here's our fucking boat. This isn't my fault. I can't point to one thing that's happened that isn't somehow your fault. Lee should have left you in Crawford. Fuck you, Kenny. <laughs> 
Careful, guys! No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katja and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they die. You said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse, and I don't know. So give me a fucking break. That's why I don't want to let them die. Oh, Ben. Um... Oh, shit. Here they come. In the house. Like a man's a college kid, but like again, I hate him. <laughs> For a college kid, he could have played it smarter. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure <laughs> this place. Krista. Uh, Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Go upstairs. Secure whatever you can and make sure we're alone. Done. Ben. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. Got it. Omi! Oh, hey. What is it? Front doors! Help me. Lee! Help! Cut their fucking arms off! There's gotta be a knife or something in there! Hurry! Okay. <laughs> All right. Take their goddamn arms off! Slice. 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 Get him. Oh. Now what? Get ready to fight. This place seems sturdy to me. I think we're fine. Sturdy my ass! Get oh, there's, upstairs! Go! There's Bree. Dragon injury, bro. Guys, help me with this! Black power. Everyone get to the end of the hallway. What do we do now? This will slow him down. <clears throat> get to the end of the hallway and take a fucking stamp. Can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Two. Y'all know where to aim. Get ready. Dropped it down there. That could have gone better. Everyone okay? Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get <laughs> Clem and catch up <laughs> to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. 
Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon Kent the Third, Industrial... Mead? Krista. Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. What's I'm sorry. There? So, no ideas then. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> hey, you're not looking great, and you're warm. Hey, don't stop. I'm okay. I'm wearing pants. No. What did that mean? She's at the hotel where her parents were staying. Why you leave the button? He hasn't quick. moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Like I said, everyone needs to keep looking for a way out, damn it. We're trapped in here. Do you think that worked? I, I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. He looks fine to me. Okay, what do you want to do? Just talk about it. Does that conversation end with me getting something dropped on my head? Now, hey! <laughs> Guys, I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. Oh, I'm really glad I got you looking out for me. For Clem. This is just fucking great. Relax, Lee. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me! We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to! You ruined that dude's face. Shut up, sweetie. Look. It's corroded to hell. What's on the other side of this wall? A 30-foot drop? No. This mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be damned. This wall ain't shit. Is this really possible? Yeah, we can do this. Okay. We'll work in shifts. Omid, Krista, and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. I'm glad you told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. yeah. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us. Which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I am. And when it happened? I panicked. But now I feel it inside me. Like the day before you get the flu. It's horrible. It's so weird. I keep doing a double take on your arm, expecting it to be there. I'm hoping whatever's in their bite is gone too. What do you think the odds are of that? I don't know. I know everyone's wondering. Even if it just slows down the process, I'd be happy. You don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? Make sure he never does it again. Figure out who he is. We figure out who he is and why he's doing this. 
We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So, did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, you know, whatever happens to you... Uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? Oh, no. The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off! What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. Find a family for... I want you to guys take it. Find her a family, okay? Somewhere she'll be safe. Don't do this. I want you to hear me. I hear you, but I'm not having this conversation. Krista, we could look after her. As long as she has a family. You hear me? Yeah, of course. What about him? We uh, got to support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? Nah, that was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. The kid killed Kenny. The kid killed his family, so there's been some tension there. Really? What happened? Kenny's son got bitten during a raid by some gang that Ben was secretly helping. They used Kenny's wife, died because of their son. Jesus. Well, seems like it got through to whatever that's good for. All right, I'm out of gas. You look good and rested. Sure, if you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can. Shouldn't be long now. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that uh, feeling any better? Feels... Still feels pretty recently chopped. So no, Kenny feels about as uh, good as you'd expect. I mean, <clears throat> do you think it worked? Did it did it help at all? I feel like a man who got bitten. So take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. It'll be all right, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Easy. He wanted to die. In Crawford. What's that now? When I had him there, in my hand. He wanted me to drop him. He asked me to. Oh, Jesus. What? I'm glad it was you making that call and not me. <laughs> this guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's g <clears throat> I don't know why it turned off. This place seems pretty sealed off. Well... She left me, my son, people that cared about us. I forgive her, but it don't make it any less wrong. You don't just end it, because it's hard. 
You stick it out, and you help the folks you care about. So let's figure a way out of here and get that little girl. We should move. Yeah. Got at least one shot left. Let's clear the room before we move on. Lee, figure out where we're headed. Out the door, I guess. House is full too. Stay quiet. Okay. Wait, their main bedroom is next to an attic? <laughs> it's kind of funny. Nothing other than personal items in here. Looks like we can stay off the streets all the way to River Street if we're careful. Let's go. Go ahead. Fucking mouth. <laughs> Holy fuck! What are we gonna do? Ken? <sighs> Kenny and I can handle this. Dude, let me help you. You're already hurt. Even more reason we all don't need to risk it. You worry about her. And if all this goes bad, you might be Clementine's last hope. Well... Keep an eye out. Ow! Um, I'm okay! Shh. Jesus. Oh, I, I, I mean, I, oh, Ben. I'm okay. Just get me out of here. Are you okay? What the fuck happened, Ben? I'm sorry. Just get me up. My legs hurt, I think. We're gonna get your ass up. Really? I thought you... Doesn't matter. Oh. <laughs> Fucking hell. What is it? I'm okay. I'm okay. We can get you up. We can, uh... Ow! Oh! Oh! He's feed me. Just yank him off that thing. What? Fast, like a band aid. Do you think? Ben. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> oh God! Don't let them get to me. Any bullets left? This has only got one left in it. I'm out. Shit. Get the fuck out of here. What? Go back. She needs you, Lee. Kenny! This is not a discussion! Hell no, man! I'm not leaving! What did I just say? Let's get Ben and get out of here! Kenny. What the fuck, Kenny? Lee, it's okay. I can't. No. No, kid. No, it's not. It's just something I gotta do. You know that. Go get that girl. 
Back, you sons of bitches! Damn it, yeah. kid! Ah, God damn it! Oh, fuck! Can you please? What happened? I heard a shot. Kenny made sure that Ben didn't feel any more pain than he had to. What? It was Ben's biggest fear, you know. Kenny had one bullet and that's how he used it. God, poor fucking kid. You saw them die? Nobody was getting out of there. I'm sorry, Lee. <sighs> he wasn't a bad guy. A lot of folks might not have always agreed. Maybe even me. We should go. Right behind you. 